Stay watchful. Spectres are still drawn to you. Oh, brilliant. You chose the schoolhouse too. Of course. Our last night together. I knew it. And now the question is, how do we reach it? I like your doll. What are you doing? This is Aleja. She is a witch. And she is running away from Spanish soldiers. She had a horse. But he died. He was an old friend. <laughs> Patience and care. You know that we have to be twice as good as them to get half of what they have. <sighs> than she was a knight. Of course she is. We could train in secret. Practice what she's not looking. These are memories from my childhood. But why here? This isn't over yet. Did we miss a few? Over there, a passageway. It's just us here and there. Damn it! The void centers in on us. Perhaps you've been thinking about your past and memories of manifesting. Or the other way around. Attention! childhood friend is here. What passed for my friend? Right. We leave now. You explain later. <coughs> Mama? Mama! It's just the game. What? What's going on? Go on. Burn them. Burn the fire melt your shackles. Careful, Red. It's close. I love doing that.
playing with us. Wants us to feel powerless. <laughs> I'll feast on your soul. You won once. Never again. Never again. Come and play, Antea. You will never leave this place. You can't go around the fire. Oh, you're back there. All alone. No one to play with. No one to talk to. Poor little Antea. Gifted and talented. Constantly. Bound. Abandoned. Go to hell. Look at you dead, clinging to some pitiful soul in a hopeless search for meaning. Thank you, Rory McVeigh, for bringing her to me. This thing serves the Aralu, Red. Don't indulge it. You'll soon be mine. Your voice, your soul, everything. Damn you. You want to play, Calendre? Fine. Let's play. At last you visit Calendre, your bestest friend. We are not friends, and your name is not Calendre. <laughs> Perhaps I should name myself by what called me to you. Your weariness? Your solitude? <laughs> your arrogance? For years, I would not shoulder the weight of what I did. I would not face my regrets. I would not wear my guilt. My home burned to the ground. My face was marked forever. When I look in the mirror, I think of you. I fled the family I'd nearly killed. I buried my true feelings in hate for you. No more. I loved you once. You were my sister. You are my soul. But I understand now that you were born of all this darkness, that you thrive on it. And because of this, I forgive you. I forgive Calendre for being nothing but a mirror. And I forgive myself for not knowing better. And you, Rory McGrath? Can you forgive her for leaving you alone and unloved and haunted? Only by her memory. The souls we banish end up in the void. I know this now. I pity them. I pity you. Your pity means nothing to me, mortal. You are nothing. How convenient, then, that I don't need you to give myself closure. Antea, Antea. Such a clever girl. So good with words of power. Is that how you seduced your little pet here? And I am the relentless servant of the Queen of Kerr. The hell? Come, stay a while, stay forever. Must I do everything? All right, 
That's cheating. We must focus on the sorrow. Then we can end this. I will reap your soul this time. I'm stronger and faster. I'll destroy you. Demon, we've a game to end. story. I'm sorry. No need. Please, let's get out of here. <laughs> 